Hi, my name is Frank Schaefer, and uh, it's cold today here in Massachusetts. What better place than a frozen winter landscape to discuss what happened to us in 2016 and 2017 and to look forward to 2018. There is a tsunami coming that is going to sweep away the Republican majority in the House of Representatives if you do your job and I mean each of us personally. The Wall Street Journal this morning was gloating over the fact that the Democratic Party's ambitions to take back the House and also state representatives is not matched by financial backing from donors. Unlike Trump, the Koch brothers, and the other oligarch billionaire white supremacist club that is now the Republican Party, I should say that is now what is left of the Republican Party. The Democratic Party actually represents you and me, not perfectly, not well sometimes, but it's the difference between sanity and a vision of the future that is livable, whether you're brown or white or woman, Hispanic, gay, transgender, and an unlivable future, more like Handmaid's Tale. If Mike Pence and the evangelical theocracy movement continue to use Donald Trump to stack the federal judiciary with right-wing ideological purist hacks, bad at what they do, but pure in their theology, evangelical right-wing theology about taking America back for God. So as we look toward 2018, I can just say this. If you're someone who dislikes Donald Trump and everything that he has brought with him, the Republican Party's giveaway, to billionaires paid for by the middle class, if you don't like the idea of Medicaid, Medicare, Social Security being slashed by people as they save the budget from their own deficit, which they have expanded by giving billionaires tax breaks this year, if you don't like that gay people, transgender people, black drivers, and others don't feel safe in this Republican theocracy that we have unfolding around us, then you have to donate to the Democratic Party. You have to donate to your local candidate. You have to volunteer. You have to get involved. Someone else out there somewhere is not going to do this. It's you and me. That's why I've been going cross-country on my own nickel as, a, as an underpaid writer, I may say, to interview Democratic candidates. Will it do any good? I don't know, but I'm using whatever little following I have on Facebook and Twitter and YouTube the best I can. We can each do something. This isn't going to fix itself. 2018 depends on you personally. If you haven't written a check, if you haven't donated to a Democratic candidate, if you haven't volunteered or in some way got involved, and above all given some money, then for God's sake, please never complain about Donald Trump again. Don't complain about the creeping authoritarianism we find in this country where we have the ridiculous spectacle of a president of the United States lining his cabinet up to each essentially praise him to the point where it would be unseemly and embarrassing for a North Korean dictator. That, that quality of lick-spittle sycophant praise that people like Mike Pence lavish on him to feed his insatiable ego. If you don't like this picture as it unfolds, donate, volunteer, get involved. That's it. It's as simple as that. And then let's face 2018 with courage and conviction and make whatever sacrifices need to be made to take back the house in 2018 and move forward to 2020. It is not victory over the Republicans we want. It is to smash the rise of the alt-right, the neo-fascistic movement controlled by white oligarchs like the Koch brothers. It is not enough to defeat these people. The message has to be the complete destruction of that level of intolerance. Thank you. <clears throat> My name is Frank Schaefer.